The two men vying to replace Tim Walls in Congress went toe-to-toe -to -toe today in a spirited debate at Minnesota Public Radio. John Croman was there and we saw a sharp contrast, didn't we, John? Without a doubt, Carla, Democrat Dan Fee and Republican Jim Hagedorn are duking it out in Minnesota's first congressional district with control of Congress also in the balance. Now, you may remember Hagedorn briefly shared the stage with President Trump last week in Rochester because Republicans are pushing hard to take back that southern Minnesota district that's been in the hands of the DFL for the past 12 years. Hagedorn has vowed to work with President Trump. Fian, by contrast, says that he will do what is best for his constituents, his constituents, and he will be doing that on a case by case basis. Because I'm an independent voice that's not beholden to any party leader or any corporate special interests, I'm willing to work with the president when it benefits Southern Minnesota. But you better believe I'm willing to stand up to him when it doesn't. You know, I think uh, when you look at it, you're not an independent voice. You're a very left leftist voice, and you're going to go back there and you're going to work with Pelosi, and you're going to work against uh, the president every step of the way. His entire career has been based in Washington, D.C., he is an insider to what these things are about and what he would bring there. I, I don't understand why he doesn't just become, there, there's some openings in the Trump administration. I, I think there, there'd be a great opportunity for you to continue your work there. Well, before I was in Washington, I was, uh, I grew up on a farm in southern Minnesota. Truman. As did I, Jim, My, which is dishonest you for you, you to you didn't one, at at time, one at a time. Dan, you didn't grow up in this district. There are 21 counties in this district. Where did you live? Before you came here to run for I Congress, I grew up in the first district of Minnesota, which no, included Dan, Red Wing, well, Minnesota, Jim, well, which you're including being, then hang on, Tim hang on. Penny at the time. Let me, let me. You're being disingenuous and phony. So when Dan Fian lived in Red Wing, it was in the first district. Now it's in the second district. Now both of them left Minnesota for parts of their lives. Hagedorn to work as a congressional aide, and then for the Department of Treasury. Fian served two tours of combat duty in Iraq and worked as a teacher in Indiana and at the Pentagon. Back to you, Carla. I want to say oofta in response to that. My goodness. And a lot of name dropping there too, right? Yep. Very fascinating. Thank you so much, John.